this is a short video to show you how to connect your BeagleBone Black or the USB connection to the internet if you're using Windows. First you have to share your internet connection to the BeagleBone Black. In order to do that, we right click our network connection symbol and open Network and Sharing Center. In the Network and Sharing Center what you will see is all the different network connectivities and settings that you can do. On the left hand side what we want to do is change the adapter settings. In here we see all the different adapters including the Wi-Fi connectivity that my computer has, the network connectivity to the Internet which is in this case a Realtek PCIe card and the Linux USB Ethernet driver which is the connection to the BeagleBone Black. So what we want to do is share the this connectivity which is the Internet with the BeagleBone Black connection. In order to do that, we right-click on Ethernet and change its properties. Once the property menu shows up, which sometimes can take a little while, we click on the tabs on sharing and what we want to do is we want to allow sharing of this interface with other networks and more specifically we want to share it with the local area connection 3 which we can see is our Beagle Bone Black. We click OK and what will happen is that our interface now is shared. Next, for some reason, once you start sharing this network, the local area network 3 will actually change its IP address. So we have to go back into the Linux USB Ethernet driver, wait for its properties to appear, we select the TCP IP 4 selections and here instead of 137 we have to switch back to network 7. We hit OK and now we can start a SSH connection to 192.168.72 we are prompted with our login. In this case, we are on a Debian system. And the logging is actually taking some while because it's not properly set up yet for its DNS records. But once you're logged in, all you have to do is become root. And then we have to add our gateway. If we route add default gateway one into one sixty eight seven one. In this case the route was already set up, so we can check this by a route dash n and we can now see that there is a default destination route that's set up over our USB connection. The other thing we want to check is that our DNS server is actually set up. In this case, the set DNS setup was set up to 10.0.1.1. This is not what we want, so let's edit our DNS server settings. In this case, we just want to use the Google DNS servers. And if we now ping Google, we can see our internet connection is there. This allows you now to update your system, download, different applications and um, get network connectivity with your BeagleBone Black on Windows.